That's fabulous. Wow. Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have a little, I don't know, oddity, <laughs> variety. Variety video. From Aldi. From Aldi. So, you know, we love our Aldi. If you didn't know, we love our Aldi. We have a huge playlist, actually. I mean, I think we, we've we done well over 100 wow, videos. Wow, that's a lot. So we will link that playlist in the comments below but um yeah whenever we go in there we always are on the lookout for new things and we always find at least a couple of new things right mm -hmm. they're always changing it up and this time this is what we found that was new unique different at least things we've never tried before so if you have tried any of these let us know first up we have an interesting water and we just tried a probiotic soda yeah but this is a probiotic water. Yeah, this is Karma brand and it is blueberry lemonade flavor. I mean, the flavor sounds good. The probiotic yeah. soda surprised us, so mm -hmm. we'll see how we'll see. we feel about it in water form. This is, I think, the star of the show. Oh yeah. Without even trying oh, yeah. it. You know. Just being able to smell it and just by what it is. This is everything Frank's in a blanket. Yeah. When we showed this in our grocery haul, one of our UK friends said that they prefer theirs wrapped in bacon. We do both here, actually. Yeah, we do. Um, and I would say I wouldn't um, say no to either. <laughs> yeah, I, I would eat both of them for sure. Yeah. Wrapped and then, in bacon, wrapped in dough. I mean, with everything what's wrong bagel with that? seasoning. I'm sure it's going to be good. I'm sure too. This one, though, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to think. I don't know what to say. But this is uh, from Simply Nature brand, non-GMO, uh, vegan ingredients, gluten-free, plant-based, cauliflower potato chips, sea salt flavor. Um, I don't know how I feel. <laughs> Let's try we'll water first and then... <laughs> you want to go we'll easy get... with it, huh? Yeah, in case we need to wash <sighs> this down. Wait, what is this? There's like a, a powder on top. Really? It's, I wonder if that's the flavor, like this is just water, and then you put the flavor inside. Let me see, are there directions? Yeah. Let's see, the undiluted truth in digestive health. Probiotics and kombuchas and other pre-mixed drinks deteriorate over time, but Karma's patented protective push cap guarantee that our pri proprietary blend of essential vitamins and cultures is delivered at peak potency. Nice. But yeah, but how do you work it? <laughs> There's like a, a plastic thing on the top that you're, it looks like you're supposed to peel off. Okay. I did that. What does that do now? They also had other flavors. So if I can find what the other flavors are, um, well, actually I did an Aldi fine short. Maybe I'll just leave that below and i think i took pictures of different ones oh interesting oh look at that so Let you just push see. down on the cap and pop all the little color crystals loose all right shake it up okay now it looks like blueberry something huh <laughs> yeah the funny thing is we were when we first got this and we looked at it we we're talking about how we appreciate that it's just like clear and no colors and stuff like that <laughs> no it's got the crystals in it we never knew that yeah well i don't know about appreciate i don't know if that's the right word we were kind of interested because if you see blueberry normally you think it's going to have a color whether it's natural or it's not right you think blue so not anymore. I mean, it's not clear yeah. anymore. All right, yeah. first yeah, sniff test. It, it smells really good. It smells mm -hmm. like candy, actually. Just going for another sip. That's fabulous. Wow. Wow. Like actually fabu fabulous. Here's what I'll say. 
I definitely get blueberry. The lemonade is slight. It's not like sickening sweet or, to, like, or too, too tart. tart. It's um, definitely blueberry forward, I would say. But that is good. That's impressive flavor. That's great. And I know that there was at least two other flavors. We'll, we'll put what they were in the comments. Yes to this. Yeah. There are 20 calories per serving. One serving size is the bottle. So. Okay, cool. I mean, and well, it tastes good. it tastes sweet. Like yeah, it tastes good. Yeah, sweet, not too tart, and there's no um, uh, like any sort of like aftertaste or anything no. like that. No, that's good. That's very very pleasant. Okay, so now moving along to cauliflower potato chips. Okay. <sighs> Let's see. They kind of smell like when we've had veggie chips before, you know, that are made of peas and carrots and whatever else. Yeah. That's what they smell like. The texture is different than a potato yes. chip. Cheers. It's not bad. They remind me a lot of like, um, like, Potato sticks, kind mm -hmm. of the flavor that goes with potato sticks. Mm -hmm. They um, they're like pressed, like a Pringle. Like a Pringle, is the texture. Yeah. The flavor. Here's the here's the thing. They don't taste exactly like a Pringle. The texture is like a Pringle. They're way even though it says sea salt. They're not salty, really. No, Very not really. light salt. Light salt. And I think you could give these to kids and they would eat them. Don't tell them what they're eating. Yeah. But I, I think I, they would eat them. I think you'd give them to me and I would eat them. But they're not. This is three and a half servings. So imagine, you know, a third of that, which is maybe like a handful, right? It's still 130 calories. So better for you thing to eat, but still not low calorie. Right, right, right. They're decent. Yeah, we'll eat these for sure. Yeah, they're decent. Yeah, it's not like a gigantic um, flavor bomb or anything like that. Mm -hmm. It just tastes like a potato snack. I feel like I want to dip. Yeah, yeah, let's. Let's throw all kinds of other stuff in with it. <laughs> dip. <laughs> well, it could be like Greek yogurt dip. Yeah. yeah. With like seasoning. Yeah. So it's not necessarily like crazy. You know, you don't want to pick a better for you chip and then, right. you know, dip it in like queso. <laughs> True. I mean, maybe you do. Well, I, mean, I, mean, I want anywhere to. Anywhere you can save, right? All right. So now, what about these? These are the everything Frank's in a blanket. All right. So these had to cook in the oven for yes. 17 minutes. Okay, cheers. cheers. Come on. <laughs> That's good. That's real good. And it might be super, super really good right now because we've done the, a bunch of videos and we've had like candy and sweets and everything. Yeah. There's only so much you can try of that. Mm. Those are great. Really like them. Mm hmm. How many can you eat? The serving size is four pieces. How many calories? Four pieces. 240. 290. Which wow. I said that wrong. I was going to tell you the calories and ask you how many there were. But yeah, four pieces, 290 calories. Woo! That's a lot. And you know what? Actually, it could be, I could very easily eat this whole thing just myself. You know? It's right. Not that, it's not that over the top. There are 12 pieces in there. 860 calories for the whole box. That's I mean, a lot. which, you know, you eat a 
meal at McDonald's, you're well over that anyways, you know? Well, yes, for sure. But yeah. also, in, uh, maybe for lunch you would have just that. But mm, if you're eating that for true. dinner, right. you're probably going to do this. Maybe you're going to have fries. Maybe you're yeah. going to have ketchup or dip or sauce something. or yeah. something. So it's going to end up being like More. McDonald's. Yeah, for sure, <laughs> yeah. Those are good. Those I'm going to say, to tell you that... I'm gonna be real because that's all I know how to be. Those are not worth the calories for me at this point in my life. They're good. That's way too many calories for me for what they are. Yeah. And good for though for an appetizer or Yeah. Like, I mean, if you were gonna have people over, you probably just make them yourself because to have this is just 12 pieces, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, but they are good. I mean, you could put them out for somebody. Yeah. A guest for sure perhaps. I think the quality is really good the they're cooked perfectly too like um, they're not too crunchy they're mm -hmm. not doughy you know sometimes these things like this get a little weird yeah. doughy you like where the grease from the hot dog meets the dough it gets a little funky mm, yeah it's not like that the everything bagel seasoning is nice but it's not too much mm -hmm. I like what? them what I found was that the dough, like wrapped around there, before cooking it, it was so thin. It was like, it looked like a tortilla, kind of. Really? So I found it interesting that they puffed up like that. I wasn't really sure what to expect. Hmm. But pretty nice. Cool. Very okay, nice. let me see the Very young. drink. I'm going to say, to tell you the truth, I feel like this is the winner of this video. That was good. I'm, I mean, these are good. Uh, these are good. They're really good. Uh, which would I rather, ha which, you know, would I sit down and enjoy the most? Probably these, if I'm being real. But I am, but I expected to like these. This, I am surprised by how much I like it. It, forget about health benefits. This is just a really good drink. Yeah, it was, it was really cool that, you know, it kept it separate. How you pop the top like that. That was really neat. Yeah. And, uh, you know, maybe, I don't know. I don't personally know anything about it, but... Maybe there is something to, you know, like the probiotics degrading over time. And yeah. So, I mean, that makes you know, sense, right? That's cool. So we tried um, probiotic soda also. Do you remember if you like those better or this? I think the flavor was better with this, with this water. I liked them both. but I, I liked think, them both too. I think I'm most impressed with this. This is at Aldi right now, and it makes me want to go get the other flavors. Yeah. Yeah. And more of this one, because I've brought it before. What do we have a lack of in the world is blueberry things. That's right. <laughs> Whenever, you, you can guarantee if there is a new soda, candy, whatever, and it comes in blueberry flavor, and we have to make a choice about, well, this is, you know, like this. It's a probiotic water. We just want to see what it's like. Right. But because they have blueberry flavor, that, like, put it over the top. That's the one we were getting. Yes. <laughs> Good thing John likes blueberry too. I'm impressed with that. I would get this over and over and over and over again. I would get this to feed other people or if I didn't have to be careful with calories, I would get mm -hmm. it again. Mm -hmm. These, I want to like them more than what I do. I do like everything about that it's, you know, vegan ingredients and if you're vegan, that's great that you can eat these because a lot of times there's like animal fat yeah. used in like frying potato chips and stuff. So that's great. And I, you know, gluten-free and plant-based, I, you know, I like all of that. Just for the calories, they're, they're pretty similar to normal potato chips. So if I'm going to have something like that, I'm probably just going to get regular, but they're decent. The other thing that I don't understand really is a lot of times when you see like cauliflower as an ingredient on something or as a replacement, it's um, because it's like keto friendly, right? So I'm looking at this, the total carbohydrates per serving is 19 grams. Now there's two dietary fibers, which you're gonna subtract, So, there, but there's still 17 grams of carbohydrates in each serving so this is not keto friendly so i no. don't really even understand the well because it's it. not a cauliflower chip it's cauliflower potato 
Okay. So they're just taking out some of the potato and adding cauliflower. Yeah. Yeah. And also it is a good way to get different nutrients. You know, you're getting cauliflower there too instead of just like starchy potatoes. So okay. I get it, but like if you're just paying, so I understand it as far as like, you know, eating different things and you know, like I already said, but as far as like, do I want to trade my regular potato chips out with those? I got to save a bunch of calories for me to do that. So yeah, I'm, I probably wouldn't buy these again. I agree for that reason, but they're decent to eat and we'll definitely eat these. So there you have it. I'm going to rate this. I'm so impressed. I don't remember how much they were. Maybe like $2. I'm going to, and I feel like we're going to try to add, you know, we're doing little steps, right? Move a little more, drink a little bit more water, make some healthier choices. I want to add a probiotic drink to our diet, I would say, a couple times a week. I would get that again for sure. And because I'm so surprised by it, I'm going to give that like an eight and a half. I'm really impressed with it. Yeah, yeah. I, I agree. Eight and a half is good with that. This um, is probably like an eight for me. I really, really, really like it, but I don't think they were cheap. I can't remember now how much they were, uh, but they're really high in calories. I mean, here we are talking about calories. This is not a health food uh, channel slash video, um, just for me personally. I'm paying yeah. more attention to that right now. Yep, yep. Um, I like those a lot. Uh, I'm going to give them an eight as well, and um, I, I would get them again, but occasionally I would say. Yeah. And then these I probably wouldn't buy again. I appreciate what they're doing. They're all things considered, they're probably like a six and a half for me. Maybe six. I don't, you know. Yeah. They're alright. I don't love them. I'd say six for me. And uh I agree. They're alright. I don't love them. I probably won't get them again. Okay. There you have it. Let us know if you've tried any of these or what you want to see us try from Aldi next time. We're always on the hunt. And the last couple times we've went, it's kind of like, oh my gosh, have we tried everything at Aldi? Is that possible? <laughs> so if you have a good suggestion, please let us know what are the things that you pick up from there. Uh, tell us in the comments. And while you're there, you can subscribe to this channel. We'll pin a comment with links to subscribe along with our other channels where we do other things. And our links to a couple of our socials are there too. Now, if you love Aldi, or uh, pigs in a blanket. Yes. Everybody loves those, right? right? Or probiotic drinks that you're impressed with, or the fact that they're adding other vegetables to potato chips, because I actually do dig that. I love carrot potato, I think. Or beet potato. Or us. Or the or video. The video. <laughs> Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps our channel grow when you do that. That's all we have for today. That's it, guys. See you next time. Bye.